Tag TV brings you daily news bulletin from India. Breaking news and views from India. You are watching South Asia Newsline and here are the top stories we are tracking for you on Wednesday, the 24th of January. Indian Opposition Congress Party terms Mamta's TMC as strong pillar of Indie Bloc. Bhutto Sayan aims to focus on Pakistan's youth break with old politics. And Maldives informed Chinese vessel will not conduct research in its waters. And now for all the details. Soon after India's West Bengal Chief Minister Mamta Benerji on Wednesday declared that her party would contest the upcoming Lok Sabha polls alone in the state, Congress party said that the Indi alliance without her presence is not imaginable. While addressing media during Bharat Jodo Nyayatra in Assam, senior Congress leader Jairam Ramesh said TMC is a pillar of the Indi alliance and the Yatra is entering West Bengal tomorrow and discussions regarding seat sharing are being done. He expressed hope that a solution would be found so that the alliance parties would fight in the state as a coalition. The Trinamool and the Congress have bickered for weeks over seat sharing arrangements for the Lok Sabha poll in Bengal, with neither side ready to back down. I will say that India Gadbandan is a TMC. India Gadbandan is a TMC. We can't do it without कल हम पश्चिम बंगाल में प्रवेश कर रहे हैं सीट शेयरिंग की बातें चल रही हैं और कुछ ना कुछ नतीजा निका रिजल्ट निकलेगा नतीजा निकलेगा जो सभी को संतुष्ट रखेगा अहेड ऑफ द एनुअल रिपब्लिक डे सेलिब्रेशन इन इंडिया सिक्योरिटी फोर्सेस अक्रॉस द कंट्री हैव इंक्रीज विजिल टू कीप एन इंटेंस वॉच टू प्रिवेंट एनी अनटूवर्ड इंसिडेंट Elaborate security arrangements were in place in parts of Jammu and Kashmir bordering Pakistan where security personnel fixed vehicles. Security officials had also increased patrolling across the line of control ahead of the 26th January celebrations. Similar arrangements were in place at the national capital New Delhi which will host the Republic Day celebrations. Around 8,000 police officials were deployed in the city as part of the security measures. Round the clock surveillance and advanced equipment also form the part of three tyre security deployment by the Delhi Police. Surveillance will be from the cameras and we have also the police force on the ground. We have also adequately trained them that people look at faces or charles or suspicious faces, they will also check them. तो टेक्नोलॉजी और ह्यूमन इंटेलिजेंस दोनों से ही हम इसका सर्वेलेंस करेंगे सर्वेलेंस के लिए अलग अलग जगह पे हमने कंट्रोल रूम बनाए हुए हैं और हर कंट्रोल रूम में कुछ ही कैमरों के ऊपर हमने एक एक पुलिस ट्रेंड पुलिस पर्सनल भी इनको लगाया हुआ है अहेड ऑफ जनरल इलेक्शन सी एन ऑफ अ फैमिली दैट गेव द नेशन टू प्राइम मिनिस्टर्स एंड द फॉर्मर फॉरन मिनिस्टर ऑफ पाकिस्तान बिलावल भुट्टो जरदारी हैज सेड यूथ अपील and ambitious plans to combat climate change will form the core of his political campaign. In an interview with Reuters, Bhutto said he plans to tap into widespread anger and added he has a concrete plan to provide free electricity and boost social safety programs despite fiscal constraints. What we propose is to completely restructure Pakistan's development model, he was quoted as saying. Zardari is less than half the age of three-time Premier Nawaz Sharif, whom analysts consider the front-runner in next month's election. The eventual winner will, however, face the task of reviving a struggling of 350 billion US dollar economy, grappling with historic inflation and unstable rupee currency. I think it's absolutely important for us to engage with what 60, 70 percent of our population at the age of 35, um, and. Uh, because I am also young myself, I think there's a lot of ability uh, to relate there. Uh, and at the same time, our policies, our agenda that we have, uh, that I launched earlier today, I think addresses many of the issues that affect uh, young people all across the country. The U.S. State Department spokesperson Vedant Patel on Tuesday called Taliban's actions against women unacceptable and said that their treatment of women and girls in Afghanistan remains a big concern for Washington. 
Patel said that the Taliban and its treatment of women and girls, its lack of human rights, basic human rights in everyday society, continues to be something of great concern to the U.S. However, the Islamic Emirate has said such concerns are baseless and the women's rights are respected. No country has formally recognized the Taliban's regime in Afghanistan due to these restrictive policies they have imposed on women. The Maldives Foreign Ministry on Tuesday informed that the Chinese vessel, which is on its way to Maldives, will not conduct research while in the archipelago's water in the Indian Ocean. Notably, the ship is expected to reach Male in a week. The ministry in a statement said that the Chinese vessel Xi'an Yang Hong 3 will only make a port call for rotation of personnel and replenishment while in its waters. Such vessels are not officially military ships, but India and other countries worry about the military use of their oceanographic research. Its presence is likely to raise concern in New Delhi, which has previously viewed such vessels close to its shores as problematic. New Delhi in its past has flagged similar visits by other Chinese research vessels with its neighbour Sri Lanka, which has denied permission for such vessels to dock at its port since 2022. Sri Lankan lawmakers are set to hold a vote on a controversial social media regulation bill, which opposition politicians and activists allege will muzzle free speech in the country. The online safety bill proposes jail terms for content that a five-member commission considers illegal and makes social media platforms liable for those posted on their platforms. Mama President Ranil Vikramasinghe administration has argued the bill is aimed at battling cybercrime and does not suppress the media or government critics. Coalition of tech giants, the Asian Internet Coalition, has however termed the bill as unworkable and has warned it could impact investments in the country's IT industry, calling for extensive amendments to the bill. That's all in tonight's edition. We'll see you same time tomorrow. Good night. Tag TV brings you daily news bulletin from India. Breaking news and views from India.